I, I want to ask you about during that time, was this before 50 Cent? Death. Or was it after? Before. Uh, everything. Don't make me. <laughs> yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. The, your fans, you got a lot of fans, bro. Man, it's a You blessing. know, you was gone for a long time yeah. and people still love Twisted Black. It's crazy. And it's crazy. And I just talked about you on the show probably four months ago. I was, it, it, it was a thing with me and Kenny yeah. B. Yeah. And okay. Kenny B yeah. was a, uh, he was shouting out the yellow beads and the, and they dope. Don't get me wrong. And the trap boy Freddy's and how he's seen them and and the people in my comments went crazy. You know they like he ain't learning. He, he got he talking about them man. What about twist it back and go yeah yo? You know mm -hmm. niggas gonna talk right, that right, right. and you've been gone a long time. But but for them to come for him like that mm -hmm. and so when he came the back love, he love. came back after that after mm -hmm. they had said that and I said hey man last time you was on the show people was. Really getting at you about the twisted black and 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 the go yeah yo mm -hmm. and uh, the fact that these two guys and and I said do you remember them and he gave his explanation so I thought that was live so it's just stuff what like is that the explanation I, I'm believe me when this clip come out you will know when I posted you here lately yeah. they said uh, they were like did he uh, they you said it was yellow beezy and trap boy Freddie you like nobody else. You ain't really hear, heard had nobody like that over there in uh, Fort Worth. Big and uh, then some people said go yeah yo. Some people said uh, not only go yeah yo. Some people said uh, uh, twisted black. And I was like, man, he don't really do you. Yeah. How do you feel about like? Do you know remember them or are you just a uh, younger younger generation? I mean, I remember them because twisted black. He um DM me. He wanted to do a song and shit. But you know they they um generation like. Older classmen, I like, don't. Oh. Because it will be him. Yeah. He will be saying, <laughs> saying you know, I can roll no, up. I can't <laughs> but he just can't remember. It ain't a bad thing. No, no, no. Don't forget no, no, me, no. Baby. no he yeah. showed love. Yeah, he yeah, showed no, love, no, man. No, he yeah. he knew already, but he, he, I think he even talked, alluded to even working with you or something. Or something. Yeah, it was something like that. So, yeah. I, but when, it, when believe me, it's going to come through. You're yeah. going to be like, damn, yeah. that's where Boss Talk get out. I got another question about um because. Oh, you're going to go back to the shot? Yeah. Because when I think about women, us women, right? Right. Mm -hmm. And we go through something like that. And then to come out and look in the mirror and realize that you now have this big scar right here. You know, us women are like, oh, my God, we don't want yeah. nobody to see <clears throat> this. We wanted this, that, whatever. As a man, mm -hmm. how, it, did it affect how did it affect you? Did it was it the same for you as how we deal with it or what? Um, at the time. OK, now, I mean. 19 year old you yeah right night not only 19 year old I me mean, 19 year by that time i was on a couple of bricks and you know i had about about 40 50 000. i thought i was yeah i thought you was going down yeah drop me tops, too i things, remember fresh everything so i thought i was on time no i was super smooth no bumps no blemishes <laughs> no cut i could fight a little bit too you know yeah. you, you couldn't tell me nothing so yeah now i'm asking you a question my mother this goes back to my mother okay she, she knew so I remember one day in the mirror, I'm gonna answer it mm -hmm. detail, but I had this, they did, they had to, they had to stitch the, uh, mm -hmm. the, the um, patch on there. And I caught her looking at me one day, you know, she was changing, it came off and she was changing, so she saw it. changing the dress. She, and I'm like, what's wrong, mom? And she said, nothing, you know, I just want to, uh, I just don't want that to affect you, you know? Right. And I'm like, Oh, not that, you know, I wasn't worried about it, but it did. Not at the time, though. I, you know, because it cost 120000 just to look like this. Mm. And so they wanted to do a cosmetic surgery. I'm like, what's that for? You know, so mm -hmm. we can fix it and, and you know. Right. And I, and I elected not to do it. Um, in hindsight, I would have done it now because what, that can either make you or break you because you can't hide your face. Right. When you walk in the room, you know, little kids. The are, stairs. They're going to stare. So uh, what I would do because of the way I was built um, is if I see you staring and remember what my dad taught me, I can see you. I may be looking directly at you. I'm not saying I'm no more special than anybody else. Right. But I was Perfect vision. As a kid. Right. And if I catch you staring, I just turn and look. Right. Then they look away. <laughs> yeah. See, now, if, you look, they look if you look away, well, then, you know, I'm going to treat you with this thing. Mm -hmm. But if you ask the question, like, what happened? I'd be like, hey, I got shot. Because it was cool, but you got the man up and asked me. Right. You know? So it was hard because it's an insecurity. And then I was young and 
So I had to fight against that insecurity. I don't really have it anymore, but to, to a degree. How long did it take to get over it, though? You don't get over it. Never you don't over. ever no, get you over it. You never get over it. It just becomes a part of you. You know, my, my record label, Scar for Life Records, my group was one good side. You know, you start yeah. to use so it to use build it. off, and that's mm -hmm. who you are. Like, if somebody's going to say, hey, you know, you know Twisted Black? Nah, who is this? The one with Scar on his face. <laughs> Can't get away from that. Right. And if I had a big nose, but you know the one with the real big nose. So you just embrace it, man. Because, mm. But it can break you, too. It empowers a lot of other people, too, by the way. I just had to say that. Because so. there's a lot of other people out here who, where they're burned victims, who right. have to walk around a certain way. Life happens. And for you to move on and yeah. move on, although with confidence, when they see you, you don't look like you don't have confidence. Right. So they're looking at that and be like, man, if he can do that and become this person, I, I sure can do it, too. Right. So why not? You have to use it to motivate others. That's oh, yeah. how I look at it. Um, if it does, then that's great. I didn't look at it like that, you know. But it, you know, at, the, at this stage of the game, anything to help propel somebody else, man. I'm exactly. It, you know what I mean. I, I want to ask you about during that time. Was this before Fifty Cent? Or was it after? Before uh, everything. Don't make me. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? Don't 50 like Cent, because right. I'm, I'm, I'm looking at this thing, and, did, yeah. it, and did, it, did it affect your speech? Boom. No. You didn't. see what I'm saying? Okay, let me ask y'all a question. Do y'all think I have a lisp? No. No. Oh, thank you. I, I, that was just a question, because my wife is the only person <laughs> that swears I have a lisp. She, lisp but, but she only do it to it's make me It's not that mad. bad, because all of a sudden now... Oh, y'all, we have been running together, together, bro. That's one of the things. Don't get okay, caught okay, up. Okay, okay. You don't get caught up in that. No, Don't even ride. Don't even just ride, bro. You know how... Hey, you know hey, how, hey. You on, ain't got no lisp with me or him. Hold but it's a woman thing, bro. It's a woman thing, bro. You know how... It ain't got nothing to do with us. Hold on. You know how you... you you self-conscious. You might have a spot on your shirt, but you got to go out because, you, you know, you messed it up while you were in the car. That's right. But you the only one who see it. Right. But until you go to somebody and like, man, you see this messed up, I messed it up. They didn't bro, see it till right. you mentioned it. No, no, no. Okay. Damn that, bro. Okay. Let me tell you something. Okay. Before you said that, <laughs> right. before you said it was your wife, right. Everything was cool. Yeah, right. Uh -uh. Was it was cool. Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. But now, when you said it was your wife that said it, that woman power thing, man, no. don't get caught up in that, bro. Okay. No, because man, I was looking on, straight man. in your mouth when you were talking, no, and I'm like, no, you can see it no. now. We were good, man. We were good. <laughs> wow. <laughs> but hey, man, like. You know, we'll stick together like that. We'll be mad. We'll be mad. <laughs> <laughs> man, man, we'll take call over. Out to all the rappers, let's. Like Come together. That, so, so when you seen the Fifty Cent thing happen, yeah, what did you think? In the Bible it says, "What goes around comes around." I'm gonna shot me. Three weeks later, he got shot down. Well, I've seen it happen so many, many times, times, bro. Like I have a good idea. Not that that was a good idea, but something you know will be in my head, or something will happen in my life, and somebody, somebody else will take it. And beat me to the punch. Yeah. So I'm watching him, and uh, you know, of course, I was. I'm a fan of music, but I was hating on the fact that he, <laughs> like this little bitty ass bullet. This nigga ain't got no scar. Ain't got <laughs> you comparing the shots? This nigga shit ain't really nothing. No, but no, no. In your mind, you yeah, yeah, keep you kinda, young. Yeah, but nah, I wasn't that young. How old was you? Grown, but. <laughs> nah, you were young, man. You know, Fifty Cent came out two thousand. What? He was in two thousand by then. I was just like, damn, you know. So now I'm thinking to myself, well, damn, so much for Because that was always going to be my thing. Hey, dude, got shot in the face. You dig what I'm saying? He came back. You yeah. know what I mean? You know, then he kind of beat me to He him. shot, got shot nine times. Nine times. I think it was five. Nine times. They said it was nine. Hey, but salute. The movie showed nine. Salute salute. Somebody <laughs> said three. You know, everybody got it. <laughs> right. Yeah, but you know, hey. But I love, I love his creativity. You can see how he working now. Beat me Man, beat me he again. is. <laughs> Oh, you had that idea too. What is you t in prison? All I kept thinking about was TV shows. See, my end game was always the silver screen. I okay. always wanted to, you know, at the end, I want to write plays. I want to do movies and stuff like, which I still will. Yeah. Um, but when he came with BMF, when he came and, man, and Powell, and shout out to Fifty for doing it, man. He's done it well. You're killing. For having his son play him and all of that, I want to do the same thing. You know, because my, my son looked just like me. Yeah, you know? yeah. So he, he beat me. Was that his that. son who played Fifty in? Yeah. The I didn't even know that's that. That's hard, man. Yeah, man. He, hey, Cat reinvented himself real well. That's dope. You beat me to the game <laughs> shot. You beat me to the to the uh, movies. You beat me to the bag. 
Man, come help me. <laughs> You've been hanging out in Texas. I think you're in Houston yeah, a lot now. Man, man, pull up to Fort Worth. Who with it? Who with it? Who with it? I'm a stun for the grogs. Catch hate from the guys. Feel slammed. Cat it. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gon' talk.